morning Bitcoin 50k and for the beautiful 50k I have my new beautiful 50k hat I'm going to wear that one today yes 50k I told you when we get to 50k I wear my 50k hat even better if you leave a cool comment down below this video I am going to give away this beautiful bottle it's a Bitcoin drinking bottle it looks really cool just leave a cool comment down below the video and you will have this beautiful heat cool bottle from Bitcoin I will send it to you Personally, guys, 50k, here we are. I don't know if you're going to stay 50k a long time, but we are at 50k, I promised you to give away. Still a little bit sick. That's why I didn't make a video yesterday. It's a, I think it's a heat stroke or something. I've been on bed a lot yesterday, so sorry for not making a video yesterday. But today we will make another video again. Let's quickly jump into the charts over here. Bam! Indeed. Yes, we have the first chart, guys. This is the Aurox Web. Um, we can see that we reached 50k over there, 5300 even, and now we are 5100, and that's an amazing level to be. And we are going to talk in this video about why it's not leaving as well. And this BAM indicator, yes, already taught us to long over there. In this time, when the green started, when the BAM crossed the white line, and we closed above the other stepping line, that is the long. And when do you exit that long? The long, you exit that one over there at the short flag. That's the most safe one. You can also do it when the candle closes down below the stepping line. Then you have the uh, possibility of making more profits. But normally when there is a short flag, we will go down. So it's a huge amount of profit over there. 8.6% with a leverage of 10. Just do the calculation. And here you will have another long again. Really cool. Let's jump into the next chart. Bam, over here. This one is, I think, the same chart. No, this one is not the same chart, DD. This one is the day moving average chart. This is the day chart. This green line is the 50 DMA day exponential moving average and this one is a 200 day exponential moving average and you can see that they are about to cross when they cross on a day chart we call this a golden cross what do we see mostly after a golden cross we mostly see a bitcoin price reaction to the upside really cool very exciting what is there going to happen i will keep it short bam over here the gaussian channel we are fighting that line this is the let's see are we on the blx or on the this is the blx yes that's better for me um the line, the top line of the Gaussian channel is at 47,600. This candle still needs to close, close in 17 hours. This one, if we close at 50k, we are closing above that one. If we take a look again at the normal candles, then we probably are already above it. But I always prefer the hiking action candles. I don't know why. For me, just a more clear image of how the market is moving. And we have more. Yes, bam, over here. This one, this is the... Um, Bitcoin energy value oscillator. This means you can see, I just want to show you why that I want to show you because 2017 is this bull run. And in 2017, we saw this huge drop over there. Do you see? And after that drop, we just went up, 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 up. Now, if you look now, four years later, 2021, what do we see? We saw the huge drop. And after that, we are starting to go up, 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 up. So we are at the level here at 660. Now we are at the level of 300. We can still double in this uh, value oscillator. And that means that for me, the bull run is still fully um, ongoing. We are going to surpass 64K. We are going to go to 70K and so on. Because, bam, over here, you can see as well in this beautiful chart that... Um, I made this one a some time ago. If, if you look at 2013, guys, we went 212 days sideways. And then after 212 days sideways, it took in total 233 days, so another 20 days to go to the top. In 2017, we went 156 days sideways. And then it took another 100 days to go to the top. So that's three months. We are still moving inside this box. We don't know how long we went sideways, but the moment we break out of this box, that is the amount of days we went sideways. And from that moment, we can expect this exponential growth in Bitcoin to the top, which could be leading till 
you see, December 2021, maybe January 2022, maybe even November over here. Depends when we break the top of that box. Really cool. Um, do I have anything else? Um, yes, over here we have, of course, some more charts. Bam. Wow, I really feel still not like perfect. But this, guys, is the... <coughs> Sorry for that. The... I just saw that my face was like completely in the wrong place on all the charts. I'm not going to do redo that, but yeah. Um, this shows you uh, that um, normally when we see a bull trend in Bitcoin, this orange line, the Google trend is moving upwards as well. The amount of time that people search Bitcoin in Google. 2017, we went up in the price and the Google search trend went up as well. This time we are going up with the price but there is less search for Bitcoin in Google. So we are not even on the top of the market when it comes to people searching for Bitcoin. So that's very strange. So that means that all people still need to be start to searching on Bitcoin and because of the Bitcoin price going above 60K again, or we are shifting from 10. Really cool. Um, bam, over here, we have another really cool. Oh no, that was with a good bam, did he? No. Aye, aye, aye. Um, what do I say? Oh yeah, bam, over here. Ah, this is a very small image, sorry for that. But this image shows you um, the profits, the Bitcoin returns per year. Uh, really cool, check it. 2010, we had 9,900% profit. 11, 1,400, 186, 5,500, minus 58, 35, 125. You can see how often, and if you calculate the average, we come to a 200% average or about. And now this year, we are here in the bottom at 69%. If you look at the bull runs, 2013, 5,000. 2017, 1,300. So that's uh, around divided by 4. If we divide this by 4, we come around 350. So 69 would should go to 350%. So that's times 4, 5 from here, which would bring the price to between... 200 and 250k really cool and then the last chart of the day bam yes this one is about bitcoin bitcoin is still very small over there you can see it it's only 850 billion big uh, the market gold is 11 trillion the global stocks are 100 trillion global bonds are 120 trillion real estate is 300 trillion all this combined is makes Bitcoin look like nothing, like a very small market. So if from all these markets, from 11 trillion, 100 trillion, 120 trillion, 300 trillion, 10% goes into Bitcoin, then Bitcoin's market is going to grow tremendously and we are going to surpass maybe even the gold market cap. So that is everything for today, guys. Yes, I'm really still not really sharp. Um, bam, yeah. Sorry for that, but I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy the short update, give it a thumbs up, share with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and leave that comment if you want to win this beautiful Bitcoin bottle. Bitcoin bottle. So, thanks for watching, see you later today, and if not, then see you maybe tomorrow again for a maybe a little bit more fresh TA video of TD. Is that a good end? Yeah, good enough. Thanks for watching, guys. Bam! <laughs>